Hello, Shane here from Lonely Viking, and um, I saw that Stencil is on AppSumo again, and I've been using this, I don't know, for maybe like a year or something, so um, I think it's really cool, so I thought I'd do a little review, um, and then you can see what it looks like inside, and decide if maybe you want to buy it or not. Um, so let's go have a look. This is Stencil, um, when you logged in. And it's basically um, a really quick way to create social media images. So I'm just going to look at a few features quickly. And I'm going to try to be quick, so it's not going to be like a crazy long video. Um, so I'll show you some of the things I like most. Um, one of them is that you can have collections. Okay, So you can, you can um, basically put your stuff into folders if you have different brands or different things that you that you uh, want to use your images for. Um, then you can choose from a whole bunch of different sizes over here. It's got all the social media stuff. It's got ad sizes. Um, it's got headers for like blog posts or emails or whatever. And then you can create your own custom ones as well. As you can see, I have a few there. Um, that's cool. Um, basically, it comes with like 2 million over 2 million royalty free photos. So I think uh, let's just create something quickly. Well, before I do, it's got templates. Uh, what I will say is I don't think the templates are super like great looking. Uh, they're, they're like some decent ones, but nothing really to write home about. Um, so usually I'm just creating stuff from scratch. But either way, it's really quick. I mean, you might find some sort of template that you like and then you can just edit it yeah it's like a something for a travel agency or something okay it's taking a while to load which is not a good ad um let, let's make something from scratch honestly i don't really use the templates i don't think they're so great so let's go make a facebook photo Okay. Um, so we go here to photos, we can search for something. Uh, let's search for beach because that's what I long for. Um, oh, there's a beautiful photo of a beach. Okay, so that's there. I'm just going to delete this other stuff. Um, We'll just use some of their stuff and then delete these things. So they've got these shapes and stuff, which are, you know, depends on your design sensibility. I'm going to leave them for now. Uh, okay. So let's look at the text. You can choose from a whole bunch of fonts. There's some Google fonts. What's cool is you can actually upload your own fonts. So this is one that I use a lot, this Rubik one. It is a free Google font, but they didn't have it. So um, I went and added it in myself. Uh, you can change the text size. I don't know why they've got that right aligned. It seems kind of weird. I would center align it and then achieve. Um, you can put a drop shadow. I don't really like the drop shadow too much. It doesn't have any controls really, so you can't um, adjust the spread or the um, the blur. So it's it's basically like a um, like a stroke that's off to one side, which is kind of weird. So I don't really like that so much. Um, you can give the text an outline. Okay, I mean that looks horrible, but you know, um, so there's like basically the standard like text tools, okay, so that's cool. Um, I mean, just these images alone make it worth it for me, just being able to search through all these images. Then again, there's also like a bunch of icons. Obviously, if you're going to travel around the world, you can have tons of money, so maybe let's search for money. Chin. Travel around the world with your pounds on your credit card. 
How cool is that? Living the dream. Okay. Um, so that's basically images, icons. You can get all of those things. As I said, you can have templates. You can search for quotes in here. You know, like, um, I don't know. See, and then you just click on these, it'll add it in there. So like, it adds in like a little Albert Einstein quote. So if you like living on Instagram, you know, making making your money on Instagram with your duck face, then you can, you know, make inspirational quotes when you go to gym and stuff. It's really the best. Um, okay, you can upload your own photos, obviously. And then what's cool here is um, you can have logos which you can switch on and off um, so you see that's put my lonely viking logo in there you can put that where you want and then you can switch that off um, you can save your images and as i said you can put them inside of those things i mean it's really cool i think you can preview it and then uh, here's where you'll save it save it as a template so it'll go into your templates over there where you can save it just as like your uh, inside of your collections and then basically you just download it you can choose how you want it download your image it's like honestly it makes it really quick to make images like these blog headers featured images for my blog um, basically super easy and uh, yeah, I think for 49 bucks uh, for life, for making as many images as you want, honestly, I genuinely think it's a good deal. So I have um, put uh, a link down at the bottom. There is an affiliate link and there's a non-affiliate link. So if you think I'm trying to trick you into giving me money as an affiliate, then just use the non-affiliate one. Um, and just check it out. Honestly, I really do think it's uh, it's worth it. As I said, some things are not so cool, some things are really cool. Uh, cool, let me know what you think in the comments below, and cool, later.